would you like to be addressed? Mrs. Smith is fine. Alright, great. Um, so Mrs. Smith, what brings you here today? Oh, well, I just, I'm always so cold all the time in the weather, so I have to like bundle up and I, I'm so tired and I just have no energy and my, my nails are brittle and my skin's dry and my hair is brittle too. I just really don't have any energy. Okay, so when did your signs and symptoms start and has this occurred before? Um, I think about a month ago it happened. Like, I had a baby five months ago and I, I didn't have any depression or anything like that. That's what they usually tell you you might have, but yeah, I'd say a month ago. Okay, so have you tried any medications um, and has this worked for you? I did buy a cream from the store, but it was just regular cream and it took away a little bit of the dryness, but it was just temporary. Okay, so how is this affecting your life? I'm an office clerk and on the phone when I talk to people a lot of them comment on how my voice is so low and I just have no energy in the workplace and people ask me if I'm sick all the time. Okay, so I'm going to do a few assessments if that's okay with you. Okay. So um, have you gained weight or lost weight in the past month? Uh, yeah, I'd say six or seven pounds in the last month. Okay, so I'm just going to uh, do your blood pressure and vitals. Your blood pressure seems to be 120 over 74. Okay, that seems about my usual. Okay, and I will get your temperature. Okay, open wide. Okay, 36.4. Okay, I'm just going to check for your pulse now. Oh, that seems a lot lower than my pulse usually is. Mm -hmm. And just breathe normally for you, Mrs. Smith. Okay, your respirations seem to be 14. Okay. So, Mrs. Smith, I'll just give you a glass of water and have you drink. Take a sip. Okay. So, normally the thyroid gland is not visible, but in your case, it seems to be a little bit bulging. I'm just going to do a few more assessments. Can I see your nails? Okay, so your capillary refill seems to be good, but your fingernails are brittle and dry. And your skin temperature is slightly cold, and your skin temperature is pretty good. Okay, I'll come from behind and do a few more assessments. So can you um, lean forward and move your neck to the right and you'll feel my fingers palpating and tell me if you feel any tenderness. Okay, can you move your head to the left? Alright, and I'll do the same thing for the front. Okay, okay so can you tilt your head to the right Okay, and then to the left. Okay, and I'm also going to listen to your corroded artery, and I'm going to see if I can hear anything. Okay, okay Mrs. Smith, so I don't hear any breweries, which is good. However, I do, um, I did feel some lumps in your thyroid, which okay. is not normal. And um, I can also see it a bit protruding and bulging, which is not normal as well. And um, based on your signs and symptoms of you feeling fatigued and tired and cold, 
and having bright, dry, brittle nails. Um, and based on my assessment, it seems like you might have postpartum thyroiditis, which could lead to hypothyroidism. Okay. Now, we're not for certain that this is hypothyroidism, so we will do more blood tests, and these blood tests will test your thyroid hormones, okay. and we'll see if your thyroid hormones are normal or not. Um, so I'll arrange that. I'll arrange a blood test to be done. Okay. And I'll have and I'll book an appointment with your doctor. Is next <coughs> Thursday okay? Yeah, sure, that should be fine. Okay. Do you have any questions for this then? Um, well this is usually common with women who've had a pregnancy then or Yes, then um, this is um, sometimes it happens with women who have just had a baby. Okay. And is it like permanent? Like will I have the condition forever or in 95% of cases, uh, it is reversible, so oh, you will go back to your normal. Okay, and treatment, like to get rid of what I have now? So, if you do have hypothyroidism, <laughs> we'll give you um, levothyroxin, which is a, re a hormone replacement therapy. Okay. Alright, Mrs. Smith, so next Thursday is good for you? Yeah, that should be fine. Alright, I'll see you next Thursday. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome.